How you doing Wilder Ireland here? Just saying hello there here to the D4 herd. How are you? Again, I'm not really planning on anything, just uh, trying to get them used to me. Hi guys. How are you doing? This is the, the usual brave fella. Hello. And there's Brownie. Brownie in Mark II. How are you? Now this fella's getting a bit braver, look. Here. How are you? Now. He's using his lip. How are you? To watch what's going on behind me. A whitey could get a bit frisky. Now guys, you're all looking well. Of course they're very skinny. But they should fatten up quickly here now. There's a lot of rich grass for them. But it won't last forever. Isn't that right? Look at this fella now. The tongue is coming out. Here we go. Now, the teeth will be the next thing. Now he's getting used to me. Now, you see, I'm not that bad. They're all checking me. Here he is. Watch now. You see, the teeth are... They used to do this last year, some of them. They used to love licking my uh, the palm of my hand. And I'm not sure if that's just checking me out or whether they're craving salt. But you see... Now he's Fleming, look at that. That's the Fleming response when they're uh, really trying to get a good smell. They curl up their lips. Aren't you? You're checking me out properly. Now he's in. Now. Now have the hand on. I won't try and pet him, I'll just leave my hand on. There's the big old tongue. Now they're, you're okay. They're all trying to check me out now. Now they're getting a little bit, have to be careful here because they start, uh, they get annoyed with each other and then um, little old me might get caught in the crossfire, mightn't I? I have to be a bit careful of you. I do. That big fella's trying to come up, but then when I put the hand, he, he backs off. And Whitey here is quite confident, but I don't think he's confident with humans. But I've noticed he's quite dominant uh, amongst, in the herd. And himself and this guy were having a great old frolic the other evening. I think it was too far away for you to see. They were. And what do you think, Brownie? What do you think of all this? Hmm? Now, well, I'm just putting my hand there. I'm not going to pet you. Oh, I won't. I won't pet you. You mightn't like that. You mightn't. Well. They're all right. Why, oh, she's a lovely head. Now, what's going on here? They're get <laughs> you just have to watch, because they get very... Uh, I think this guy is the leader at the moment. I'm not 100% sure. He's certainly the most confident anyway. Or is it this guy? Now guys, there's Brownie. You're much bigger than last year's Brownie. Aren't you? Be careful I don't get nipped now. <laughs> you having a bit of an old chew as well? Oh, you're a good fella. Oh, you're a lovely fella. So are you. This one is a nice colour too. 
sorry guys I know they're they're just really up close and there's nothing I can do with this camera I've, I've moved the truck well I can move it a little bit more back the old selfie stick thing look at you you're all getting ready now I'm going to move and just see I'm not I don't really want them to follow me but they may follow <laughs> darn tootin good fellas I'm gonna head off now okay but you can carry on here good fellas yeah, I think they're going to stay actually now if I call them on I'm sure they'd follow but I want to leave them in peace I don't want to disturb them too much but they're getting a lot more there you can see now they're uh, a lot, lot more um, interactive there today now and uh, that's uh, I think he's the, the, the leader of the pack. He, uh, he let me put my hand on him there. I found last year, you know, a lot of, uh, if you do your research, you know, they'll say horses don't like being stroked on the head. But I don't know about that. But what I did find was, um, once they got to know me, a couple of them loved if I just put my hand on, on their head and I didn't like stroke, just put it there. And I had them, a couple of them would fall asleep when I did that. Anyway, I'm going to cut this because there's nothing to see. I'll check on the other guys quickly. Uh, that's it. Take it easy. All the best. Adios. Hello. Okay, guys, I'm just having a quick check in on the other herd. Cade Mila Fulcha herd. Okay, leader's coming over already. They actually didn't see me and they got galloped off there. They just heard me before they could uh, figure out who it was. So they're obviously uh, getting relaxed around me. Oh, is there a little bit of... Hello, guys. Now, I was just over there with the other, the other guys and uh, they're a lot more relaxed around me now. Managed to... Uh, the leader was licking my hand and let me put my hand on its forehead for a little bit. So, hi guys. So slowly, how you doing? Eating. Are you eating? Good fellas. Horses and cows have to nearly eat all the time. They need a lot, a lot of, uh, a lot of food to get their nutrition. They're not like uh, carnivores; they can just uh, survive on. Some of them can survive on one meal for a long time. Now, right? They couldn't give a hoot. Look, <laughs> as I was saying, these guys are very skinny, most of them. So they're going to fatten up here now in this. A couple here aren't too bad actually but uh, but you could clearly see the ribs in some of them how are you I'm gonna walk in I think they'll move back no hi you do what are you saying he's not in his head they do that it's quite funny So all you can hear is uh, the sound of uh, horses trying to get their weight up. Ponies. Oh. Now I've crouched down. And immediately, they're all over me. Hello, guys. It is hilarious that they're, they're threatened by me until I crouch down. Hello. Hello. Now I'm back up. Hooey. It is funny, isn't it? I didn't uh, read that now or anything. The first day I just had a little instinct to crouch down. And they immediately came over. Just a lot more relaxed now. Look, there's a little bit of bickering here, so i got to watch myself. This is... You're okay. When you need to watch because they start uh, 
having a go at each other and they kind of forget you're here sometimes. You're right. You do. Nice breeze now. The weather isn't great, but it's it's uh, it looks like it's about to rain, but it might not. But it's it's mild and that's a lovely cool breeze, isn't it, guys? Get those mains going. Isn't that right? Straight away when I when I hunker down, they're around me, in for the kill. In for the kill, guys. You're bullies. Are you bullies? No. No, you're not. They're hilarious, aren't you? That's the camera. I know, I know you didn't sign your waiver, your release, but you know, you're not in the union. You're not in the guild. Good fellas. Now I'm up slowly. Good fellas. <laughs> I do find them interesting, maybe you don't, but uh, I just love the behaviours. They're kind of semi-wild, semi-feral. Not fully wild now, I'm not trying to exaggerate. But you've really got to work to get their trust. As I said last year, I actually found it much easier after a couple of days. Now the more confident ones, there's there's it's a couple of the quieter ones. They took forever. Well, it took maybe a month for a couple of the really the really quiet ones. But most of them were um, totally relaxed. You know, this fella's interested in me now, aren't you? Huh? He's hanging around. The rest are going back for food. Oh, you're a lovely fella. Right, I'm going to head. Okay, fellas, I'm off. Now, I purposely said I was off so you wouldn't get us scared. There we go, rubbish. Look at that. Bye guys. And they're happily grazing. Okay guys, I'm gonna leave it there. If you're interested, subscribe and check out the channel. There's lots of different uh, wildlife related stuff. I know this isn't strictly wildlife, but um, anyway. And uh, all the best, take it easy. Adios.